Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the video. What if you guys today is another vision video. For today, we'll be doing another gear comparison. As you guys know, I did a video about the Sentry's gear and the Deadeye gear. And it seemed like a lot of people did enjoy that video. A lot of great feedback was left on that. So I did decide to make another one. If you guys didn't see that video, I will have a link in the description so you can go check it out for yourselves. But for today, we'll be comparing the Alpha Bridge gear set and the Firecrest gear set. Now I know the Alpha Bridge gear set is a little bit better. But the only reason I'm comparing it with the Firecrest is because I know a lot of people use it because of the faster reloading. So that's why I'm going with the Alpha Bridge and the Firecrest for this video. But if you guys do enjoy today's episode, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe for more videos, and let's get right into this. Before I start off the video, let me know in the comment section below what other comparisons you want to see on the channel. I could do anything between weapons, gear sets, or, or talents, or something like that. So let me know in the comment section below what future videos you want to see. Like I said, it could be anything from gear, weapons, talents, even attachments, whatever it is. So to start off, we're going to begin with the Firecrest gear set. As you guys know, a lot of people use this gear set, including myself. I've been using this for a pretty long time, but recently I've been switching it out here and there because I've been finding other gear sets uh, work a little bit better for me. But personally, the Firecrest gear set is always going to be my top four, maybe top five favorite gear sets in the game uh, because how really useful it is and how clutch it comes in certain situations. In my opinion, when you're using this gear set, you definitely don't want to use more than three pieces on your characters. So you could have three piece Firecrest, Savage Gloves, and like a Reckless Chest or whatever you wish for. But to begin with, the Firecrest two piece set bonus gives you plus three incendiary bullet capacity. So this is really good for the dark zone, the underground, whatever you're pretty much doing. Incendiary bullets are really clutch. Although this is going to be really useless if your teammate is already running Reclaimer and he can pop explosive bullets, incendiary bullets, water, whatever it is. So when your teammate is using Reclaimer, this is a little bit useless but when you're playing the dark zone solo or if you're playing with randoms three incendiary bullets capacity is really good moving on to the three set bonus this is why a lot of people use this in a dark zone on the ground once again uh, whatever they're playing because this will allow you to reload a hundred percent quicker personally this is the only reason i've been using this gear set for a pretty long time is i hate reloading this game i hate how long it takes reloading and to have three different pieces of gear on your character which allow you to reload a hundred percent quicker was definitely worth it for me like I said, if you're going for a Firecrest build, you definitely don't want to use more than three pieces on your character because the fourth one is pretty useless in my opinion. Speaking of the four piece set bonus, pretty much what it does is killing a burning target grants incendiary bullets for 10 seconds. So once again, this is not the worst bonus I have seen on different gear in this game. But in my opinion, you definitely want to go with three pieces for the dark zone, for underground, for incursions, for new missions, pretty much for whatever you're playing. Moving on to the Alpha Bridge gear set, this gear set is most popular in the Dark Zone in my opinion. You don't really see a lot of people using this in, you know, underground incursions. A lot of people only use this in the Dark Zone because of the 4 set bonus. Now to start off, I've been using the Alpha Bridge build for a pretty long time now and honestly, I don't really like it as much as the Sentry's build or a Deadeye build. I don't know why, just for me those two other builds are so much better than the Alpha Bridge. But to begin with, the 2 set bonus gives you 2 extra med kits. So once again, you can see why that's really popular in the Dark Zone. Moving on, the 3 set bonus gives you 100% health regen. Now, this might sound a little bit overpowered, but honestly, it's not that OP in my opinion. And last but not least, why everyone pretty much uses this gear set in the dark zone is the 4 set bonus. And what the 4 set bonus is, if your primary and secondary weapon is on the same category, they gain all the unequipped active talents. Now, this is overpowered, so if you are rocking like 2 submachine guns or 2 shotguns, and for example, let's say you have like deadly, brutal, you know, skilled, whatever talents you have, you pretty much get those talents if you have them as your primary and secondary. But once again, this will only work if you have two ARs, two submachine guns, two shotguns, whatever it is. So it is really overpowered because you get all the talents from both the weapons. But unfortunately, you cannot use like a sniper and a assault rifle, a shotgun or a submachine gun. You have to have the same category weapon. Now, if you are rocking this Alpha Bridge build and you have two shotguns equipped on your character, what you can do is get a sawed off shotgun as your secondary and then pretty much you get nine different talents because it's still a shotgun. And then you pretty much get the primary, the secondary, and the sidearm talents on your guns. But as I did mention in the beginning, I do still think the Alpha Bridge build is a little bit better for the Dark Zone for Underground. Obviously, the Firecrest has its own individual bonuses, but in my opinion, if you're going for a specific build, I would 100% recommend the Alpha Bridge build. But that's it for the video, thank you so much for watching, if you guys did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.